Hey guys, what's up? It's T Pro here, and we are playing some more Anniversary Slayer in Halo. And this is actually my second game of uh, what's it called? Halo Anniversary. Man, I'm stumbling right now. Uh, worst commentary ever. Uh, I'm a homage to Woody. Anyway, but let's restart this. Hi guys, what's up? It's T Pro here, and we're playing a game of Anniversary Slayer on Halo. Um, this is the Hang 'em High remake map, uh, and this is my actually my second game of Halo, and. You may, you may have seen the first one. I'll put a link to the first one. Uh, that, that one was on what was originally called Beaver Creek or Battle Creek. It was one of those. But um, let me talk to you about what this collector's anniversary really is. And I actually... Okay. So this is pretty much a uh, high definition. Uh, Ten years of Halo. Just, you know, just... Uh, 343 and uh, giving back to their fans. You know, they redid... Uh, the graphics engine, I mean, if you can actually press the back button and in the campaign and see how it, it really is uh, old school graphics and new school graphics, and it's very wonderfully done, it's beautifully done, it speaks to my inner childhood. When I first got this game, when I was, well, let's see here, I'm almost 21, so 10 years ago, I mean, when I was 10, I was just like... I had so much fun with this game. Now, given I couldn't get past the first level because I was freaking dumb and a kid, and I had no idea how games worked, so I was playing the game, and you know I got stuck a couple times, but I utterly enjoyed it. Once I got the hang of it, I loved Halo. Uh, I, it was the game that me and my friends played with. It was the old school Call of Duty. It was what Call of Duty was before Call of Duty. It was the first person shooter that everyone wanted to play. Heck, even girls played it, and they complained when the guys teabagged their dead bodies in Halo. Um, I kid you not, that happened in one of my classes my freshman year. Uh, it's just... Halo is a game that brings us back to who... To a funner time, a, a simpler time. Halo is the game that it just, it just was. It was the game that you wanted to play. I mean, I can't speak enough to Halo. I, I love this game. It was it, and Collector's Anniversary Edition CE, whatever you want to call it. This game spoke to the nostalgia more than anything. The only it was forty bucks. It gave you some map packs, um, uh, on the Reach Engine, uh, Reach Engine multiplayer, I should say. Uh, it was it was worth the price, pretty much. It was a game that you've played before, but that you wanted to replay. That. That, and and that also introduced some players to Halo now that haven't all necessarily played it. Uh, my boy Tectic, uh, Connor, you, you guys know him. Um, he bought an, he he got an Xbox for Christmas, and with it he got Halo Reach. And dude, don't sneak up on me like that. He got Halo Reach with his Xbox, and I don't even know what happened there. And I want I was trying to tell him, dude, if you really want to know what Halo is. Get this collector's anniversary edition, okay? Now, what, what, what do I want to say here? If you wanted to know what the real Halo was, you know, Halo Reach is nice and everything, but it didn't have Master Chief. Master Chief was the guy that everyone wanted to be, and that he was the ultimate badass. He was just like, oh, what's this entire army of, of aliens trying to destroy my home and enslave our race? Yeah, I'm just gonna be one man and take it in there and destroy them and another group of bug aliens. You know, I'll squash these little bug aliens. I'll take out your your little lizard freaks. I'll do it all because you know why? Because I'm Master Chief and this is my world. And that's pretty much what it was. That was that was the kind of feel that you got from playing Master Chief in Halo. You don't necessarily get that with uh, Halo Reach being Noble Six because you're with a team. It's not the same thing. I mean. If you want to see players that are bad in Call of Duty, that just rush in and think they can do it all, that's because they've played Halo. How do I not get that headshot? They played Halo thinking that they were just going to be ultimate badasses, run in, and just destroy everyone. Not the case in Call of Duty. And it took me some transition times when I tried to go from Halo multiplayer to Call of Duty multiplayer. I was rushing in thinking like, yeah, guns kill even quicker now than they did in Halo. I'll just go and destroy. And that just wasn't the case. That, that isn't how you play it. You have to learn the playstyles and change it up a certain way. Um, I, I, like, I don't know what else to say, guys. It's just, if you really want to know what Halo is, buy this game. And it, it's only 40 bucks. You can probably get it discounted now. And get stuck, son. It speaks to the Reach engine as well, to uh, trying to say that it's like, 
um, Halo, Halo Reach just uh, it keeps growing, growing, growing. It's still, like, what, the fourth most played game on Xbox Live. And the whole Collector's Anniversary Edition, it, it certainly helped uh, people bring into Halo. Uh, how do I word that differently? They brought people into Halo. Uh, it just, it, it, they're trying to research a generation. Especially with Modern Warfare 3 just bugging out like crap. That's just, that just doesn't work for people. And... If they, if they need another game to go to, then guess what? Go to Halo. That's what I say. And I actually had no idea what that orb thing was until I found out it was an overshield. And I was just like, what is this? And it supposedly gives me like a fire trail, hot foot. Like, I don't know. It's like, I thought it was pretty cool, actually. And like, that's the kind of stuff right there that speaks to 10-year-old uh, me saying, dude, remember how cool this was? But remember how you could only play it with four people? Well, now you can play it with 16 at the most. It's just, I, I don't know what else to say about this game right now. Um, and we still got like three minutes left in the video. I'm just going to tell you right now. I go 2011, but I lead the freaking team. I, I think I lead the lobby as well. Um, there's a guy named Optic Beast in the game when, you know, he is not an Optic player or else I would not have beaten him. But I think I'm going to start playing some more Halo, guys. Uh, I don't know what else to say. I think, uh, I think I'm just going to end it here and let you guys watch the rest. Uh... Please uh, like, favorite, and share before I ruin any more of the video with my constant ramblings of nothing. Uh, you know, if you guys want to see more Call of Duty, let me know. If you want to see more Halo, let me know. If you want to see anything, just let me know. Uh, I want to make sure that I appeal to you guys too, but I also want to be, you know, I, I want to be me as well. So, as we pick up the rockets, that's the end of my time. Please enjoy the rest of the video. Um, check out the scores at the end. Thank you guys, and have a great day. remaining. Yeah. 